In the annals of classic cinema, the shop around the corner stands as a timeless gem, leaving an indelible mark on the hearts of its audience. Directed by Ernst Lubitsch in 1940, this romantic comedy unfolds within the quaint confines of a Budapest gift shop, offering a delightful exploration of love and connection. As you reflect on this cinematic journey, consider, is there a particular scene or moment in the movie that has had a lasting impact on you? Perhaps it's the charm of the witty banter between the characters or the subtle nuances that reveal the complexities of human relationships. Alternatively, out of the many roles in the film, which one was your favorite? Before we delve into the intriguing trivia about the shop around the corner, we invite you to share your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this cinematic classic. We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Now, let's unravel some captivating facts about the movie. Did you know that the film served as the inspiration for later adaptations, including the popular romantic comedy You've Got Mail? The enduring appeal of the shop around the corner has transcended generations, leaving an indelible imprint on the romantic comedy genre. As we embark on this exploration of cinematic history, join us in celebrating the enduring charm of the shop around the corner and share your thoughts. Your insights and memories enrich the tapestry of our collective appreciation for this timeless classic. The Shop Around the Corner, directed by Ernst Lubitsch in 1940, weaves a heartwarming narrative set against the backdrop of a Budapest gift shop. The film, adapted from the play Parfumery by Mikkels Ellis Ziel, follows the story of two employees, Alfred Kralik and Clara Novak, who unknowingly become pen pals while harboring a deep animosity for each other in person. The iconic characters, played by James Stewart and Margaret Sullivan, bring charm and authenticity to their roles, creating a poignant exploration of love and connection. Lubitsch's unique style shines through the film's clever dialogue and deft handling of emotions, allowing humor and romance to coexist seamlessly. The enduring impact of the shop around the corner on popular culture is evident in its influence on subsequent romantic comedies and its timeless portrayal of the universal themes of love and understanding. The film's timeless narrative and memorable characters continue to resonate with audiences, showcasing the enduring power of classic cinema and capturing the intricacies of the human experience. James Stewart and Margaret Sullivan, the lead actors in The Shop Around the Corner, shared a long-standing connection before the 1940 film. Both were part of the University Players, a summer stock company, where Stewart discovered his acting potential. Motivated by Sullivan and fellow player Henry Fonda, Stewart ventured to New York, marking the beginning of his serious acting career. This classic movie, recognized among the American Film Institute's top 100 funniest American movies, holds a special place in director Ernst Lubitsch's heart. In his book Ernst Lubitsch, Laughter in Paradise, Lubitsch unequivocally declared it as the best picture I ever made in my life. These behind-the-scenes insights shed light on the personal and professional connections that fueled the making of the shop around the corner, contributing to its enduring impact on cinema. In the making of The Shop Around the Corner, director Ernst Lubitsch took deliberate steps to strip away glamour, aiming for authenticity. One intriguing detail is how all scenes were shot in sequence. This approach added a unique layer to the film's development, allowing actors to experience the narrative's progression naturally. Another notable aspect is the signage choice in the Budapest setting. While most signs are in Hungarian, an intentional decision was made for the advertisement, offering a markdown on cigarette boxes to be in English. This choice ensured that the audience could easily understand and connect with this particular detail, emphasizing the importance of clear communication in storytelling. Delving deeper into Lubitsch's commitment to authenticity, a fascinating anecdote involves altering Margaret Sullivan's dress. Purchased off the rack for a modest $1.198, the dress was left in the sun to bleach and intentionally tailored poorly. This meticulous attention to detail reflects Lubitsch's dedication to stripping away artificiality, contributing to the film's genuine and relatable atmosphere. These behind-the-scenes choices shed light on the meticulous craftsmanship that went into the shop around the corner. From shooting sequences to language nuances and wardrobe decisions, each element was carefully considered, showcasing Lubitsch's commitment to an authentic cinematic experience. Adapted from Mikkels Ellis Ill's 1937 play El Absurder, The Shop Around the Corner, directed by Ernst Lubitsch, delves into the intricate world of unspoken connections. 
Set against the backdrop of a Budapest gift shop, the film introduces us to Alfred Kralik and Clara Novak, employees harboring a peculiar animosity while unknowingly becoming pen pals. The narrative, while seemingly straightforward, weaves a subtle humor, such as when Kralik mentions Uribe Zola's Madame Bovary and Clara corrects him, revealing her own paradox of ideals. Adding depth to the film's authenticity, the store's cash register bears labels like Pengo and Filler, reflecting Hungary's economic history. The Pengo, once the currency, faced post-WWI stabilization, but later succumbed to hyperinflation. A poignant detail, subtly echoing the character's own struggles in an evolving world. Beyond the screen, the roots of the shop around the corner extend to Ellis Zila's play, later adapted into various forms. The first film adaptation in 1940 paved the way for subsequent versions, including a musical in 1949 and a Broadway production in 1963. The story resurfaces in different times and mediums, notably in You've Got Mail, embracing the techno age. In Lubitsch's meticulous filmmaking, he intentionally shot scenes in sequence, allowing a natural progression for the actors. The decision to use English in a Hungarian setting subtly highlights the importance of clear communication in storytelling, a theme mirrored in the character's pen-pal relationship. Notably, the choice of Margaret Sullivan's dress, bought off the rack for $1.98 and intentionally tailored poorly, reflects Lubitsch's commitment to stripping away artificiality. These behind-the-scenes nuances illuminate the craftsmanship that went into creating an authentic cinematic experience. The Shop Around the Corner, a timeless exploration of love and understanding resonates beyond its 1940 origin. As it continues to influence romantic comedies and captivate audiences, it stands as a testament to the enduring power of classic cinema in unraveling the complexities of the human experience. As we bid adieu to the enchanting tale woven within the frames of The Shop Around the Corner, let's take a moment to let the echoes of nostalgia linger. This cinematic masterpiece, an intricate dance of love and wit, invites you to traverse the corridors of your own memories as the characters' lives intertwine in a dance of fate and serendipity. Have you ever found yourself immersed in the delicate threads of connection, much like the characters in this timeless gem? The shop around the corner beckons you to explore the tapestry of your own experiences, encouraging reflection on the intricacies of human relationships and the quirks of destiny. Share with us your cherished moments, the laughter that resonated, or the tears that welled for every viewer weaves a unique pattern of emotions onto the canvas of this cinematic marvel. As you ponder the subtle nuances and timeless charm embedded in this classic, let your thoughts unfurl like a vintage letter, sharing your insights and tales inspired by the shop around the corner. The magic lies not only in the story on screen, but in the myriad of personal stories it ignites within each viewer. Thank you for embarking on this journey through the cinematic corridors with us. Your time and reflections are the threads that enrich the fabric of this shared experience, a symphony of stories intertwined. Until our narratives converge again, remember, every tale finds its own corner in our hearts.